to his son Jesus Christ and the ever present Holy Spirit. Amen. The officers and the walls of saints of God. Those here and those viewing on Facebook or YouTube or however uh, you're getting it. Amen. <laughs> We honor you today. Also. Amen. 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 Uh, by your presence. Amen. At least I be too long today. Uh, Paul's letter to the church at Colossians. First Colossians chapter 1. And just let me read verses 12 through 14. Amen. I might read 15 also. Amen. Colossians chapter 1, beginning at verse 12. Paul writes and says, Given thanks unto the Father, which has made us meet to be partakers of the inheritance of the saints in light, who has delivered us from the power of darkness All right. and has translated us into the kingdom of his dear son, mm -hmm. in whom we have redemption through his blood, mm -hmm. even the forgiveness of sins, right. who is the image of the invisible God, the firstborn of every creature. We want to talk about deliverance from the power of darkness. Right. Deliverance from the power of darkness. That ought not be any discussion or any question whether there's darkness in this world. All right. As a matter of fact, we were all born in darkness. Mm -hmm. David said, I was shaped in iniquity. All right, all right. And in sin did my mother conceive. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. For this world is clouded with darkness. Mm -hmm. Now, how can I so uh, emphatically say that? Well, Scripture tells us that the prince of this world is Satan. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. And Satan is the ruler of darkness. Wow. Mm -hmm. So actually, this world is in darkness, and the only light that's in it is the light that the Lord gives us All to right. shine. All right now. now. He told us in, in, in Matthew chapter 5 to let our light <laughs> shine. Mm -hmm. Amen. Uh, 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 Sometimes I, I, I wonder uh, uh, if we do that. Uh, uh, he wants us to let our light shine. He says, while I was in the world, I was the light. Wow. Mm -hmm. Amen. But when he left, he left it in our hands All right. to illuminate this darkened world. Amen. So therefore, we need to be delivered from the power of darkness. Mm -hmm. yeah. There was a lot of darkness in in D.C. just last month. Mm -hmm. Amen. I, I, I don't care how you put it, some of them folks was card-carrying so-called believers, mm -hmm. but they were encased in darkness. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I, 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 I say that because they had hurt, harm, and death mm -hmm. on their mind and in their heart. Let me hear you. And that is a, a, a function of being in darkness. Mm -hmm. Amen. So therefore, we need to be yeah. delivered from the power 
of darkness. Not only spiritually, but physically. Right. For there is so much darkness in this world. Mm -hmm. In this, in this, this first chapter, as, as, as Paul greets the church at Colossia, uh, he, he, he introduces Jesus, or reintroduces Jesus unto them. And, and, and he refers to him as Jesus Christ. Uh, 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 he says to them in verse 1 uh, uh, that uh, uh, I'm apostle of Jesus Christ. In verse 2, uh, 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 he says uh, uh, again, from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ. In verse 10, he says that you might walk worthy of the Lord, and in that he has reference to the Lord Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. and, and, and if he's Lord, then he must be our Savior and Master also. So now in verse 13, he can use that relative pronoun and say, who the, which is who, and refers to Jesus Christ as having delivered. <coughs> Us mm -hmm. from the power of darkness. That's what he says in 13. Who has delivered us yeah. from the power of darkness and has translated us into the kingdom of his dear son. So therefore, therefore, we we can draw from what Paul is is setting the church up uh, in Colossus to to accept the fact that. They are where they are now because Christ has delivered them My love. from the power of darkness. Guess what? We are too. <laughs> Amen. We are where we are and who we are because he has delivered us Amen. from the power of darkness. My love. Try to get through with great points, uh, Sister Queen. I may not get there, but I'm going to try. Amen. First, first, first of all, we... We must accept the fact that our deliverance has already been accomplished. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Amen. Uh, uh, it's not something being worked on. It's already been accomplished. Mm -hmm. For he has delivered us from the power of darkness. And the verb translated here, has delivered, uh, uh, in the Greek uh, uh, means that we have been drawn or snatched away from whoever it was that had us and that entangled us. Let me hear you. Amen. Now, that's something that we can uh, uh, grab hold to and, and, and sink our teeth in, okay? Christ is not pulling us. He has already done. Mm -hmm. Snatched us away. Uh, it wasn't something that took place over a, figure, over a period of time. He did it in an instant. Uh, on a twinkling of an eye, as when he will come back and claim us, he snatched us from the power of darkness. All right. Now. So we ought to be shouting about that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Amen. That, that Satan might would have had me, but he's not anymore. All right. Now. This is what Christ did. Rescued us from the deceiver and from the one that would have caused us to die and go to hell. And then this also means that he did it once and for all. Yes, sir. Amen. It, it, it's, it's no, it's no uh, uh, one of those things about you going in and out. Okay. Uh, Christ died on the cross one time. Mm -hmm. uh, and that one time was enough. Yes, sir. Amen. We don't need to crucify him afresh. Each time we sin. Now, guess what? We, even though we may sin, we have been snatched from yes, darkness. Yeah. Right. And even though we may, uh, 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 Brother Stewart, walk to the tavern door, although we may go into the tavern, we come out of there the same way we went in. Mm -hmm. All right. All right. Saved, sanctified, Let me hear you. and filled with the precious Holy Spirit. Mm -hmm. yeah. Because we've been snatched yeah. from that lifestyle. Okay. Uh, 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 
when 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 Paul talks about being snatched and being delivered, he 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 alludes to the fact that when when Jesus was was talking to them in Mark chapter two, and when he said to that man that thou sins are forgiven, and they questioned him about who can forgive sin, nobody but God, and and, and Jesus told them or uh, alluded to the fact that I am mm -hmm. God. He said, was it, was it it's easier to say, rise, take up your bed and walk all the sins are forgiven, but for you to know. All right. All right. I'm going to say it so you can accept it. Mm -hmm. He said, take up your bed mm -hmm. and walk. Mm -hmm. And because his sins were forgiven. Mm -hmm. I said something. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It wasn't because Jesus told him to take up his bed and walk. It was because his sins yeah. were forgiven. Yes, sir. That he was able to take up his bed and walk. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. It has already been done. Mm -hmm. Now, who did it? Well, Christ did. Yeah. He delivered us. No one else could have done what Christ did because no one else was a God man. No one else was willing to take upon our burden, our sin, the, the, the situation that we were in and carried them to the cross. No one. Not only did he do that, but he forgave us. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Amen. Verse 14, and says that in whom there is redemption, that means he forgave us, mm -hmm. redeemed us, and put us back in the right relationship mm -hmm. with God the Father. Mm -hmm. he, he was the only one, mm -hmm. amen, that could, could come and live a sinful life mm -hmm. and then give his life for us. Let me make some sense. Uh, 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 uh. Then, then uh, uh, we were snatched from darkness. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, we were delivered. Jesus did it. But who did he really deliver? Mm -hmm. Who are the ones that, that have been de delivered? Uh, uh, when scripture talks about Jesus, he, it, it talks about he came that the whole world might be so. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, John John three sixteen used that phrase whosoever. Mm -hmm. Amen. I I I I need to help some folks because uh, 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 Christ died for the sins of the world, but the world didn't get saved. Mm -hmm. All right. Amen. Some folks yeah. still dying in their sins. All right. Now. Yeah. Not everybody is automatically delivered from darkness. All right. Yeah, some folks like darkness All right. rather than light. Mm -hmm. wow. That's what Jesus said. Yeah. Uh, 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 they didn't come over and follow me, and they didn't accept my teaching because they love darkness more so than light. Amen. So, so who are these folks that are delivered from the power? of darkness. I'm glad you asked that. Because there are some prerequisites to being delivered from the power of darkness. Uh, these are common beliefs of the providence such as uh, 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 when God uh, blesses folks, he, he gives all of us certain blessings. He allows us to, br to breathe his air and to enjoy his sunshine mm -hmm. and, and, and give us all physical life. But then there are some things that you will receive only because you've been delivered. Let me hear you. Right. From the power of God. Yeah. Wow. You can only be delivered when you accept Jesus mm -hmm. as your Savior. Yeah. Wow. You can only, only, only be delivered yeah. from the power of darkness when you have faith. In the deliverer. Yes. I come to tell you that if you don't believe in Jesus, right. 
then you still in darkness. Mm -hmm. If you can't accept what he has done for you, mm -hmm. you're still in darkness. Yes, sir. Yes. If you're not willing to take up your cross yes. and follow him, yes. you're still in darkness. Well, well. Because you have to realize that he has come that you might be delivered from God. All right. And if you will not believe in him, if you will not trust him, if you will not follow him, wow. then there's no way for you to be delivered from yes, God. Well, what is the power of God? Yes, well, it is being under bondage of Satan, wow. allowing Satan to control your life. Well, right. allowing Satan to tell you what to do. Uh -huh. I come to tell you today that Jesus is the only one uh -huh. that can break the bond that Satan has on you. Well, well. I, 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 I got to tell you this, that he called us when we came from our mother's womb uh -huh. and started to work on us. Uh -huh. Yeah, even as we grew, we grew understanding wrong and right. Yeah. And I don't care what you say. All of us like doing some wrong. <laughs> All right now. <laughs> All of us like doing some devilish men. Well, well. Satan has. Us. <laughs> yeah, doing his bit. Yeah. <laughs> but thanks be unto God yeah, that Jesus came into our life. Well, yes. I'm glad for the song that said Jesus loved me. Yeah. This yeah. I know. Yeah. And once we learn about Jesus, wow. we can understand that we were walking in darkness. Well, well. Yeah, we understood then that we we're living a life that will lead us to him. Mm -hmm. But I'm glad that light came. Yes. And we saw Jesus mm -hmm. as the one who was able to deliver us. Yes, sir. I was I was watching watching a a, 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 a preacher just last week. And he said that uh, uh, he said I didn't have a, a young adult life. Mm -hmm. He says, I grew up in the church. Mm. I started playing for the church mm. when I was a young teenager. Mm. And, and, and I didn't have a chance to do all of that stuff mm. that some of y'all did. Mm. But then he said, I still sin. Mm -hmm. And he said, I sinned while I was in the church. Well, Some of us could agree to that. Yeah, we didn't live a sinless life. Well, well, Although we were brought up in the church. Yes. Although the Lord saved us, yes. we still did some wrong. Yes. But thanks be under God yes. that when Jesus snatched us uh, yes. out of darkness, uh, it was a one and done. Yeah, I hear him talk about the NCAA basketball tournament being one and done. Well, Jesus died uh, one time for us, uh, and in him dying, uh, he snatched us from the very doorsteps of death, uh, caused us uh, to be redeemed. Uh, I heard uh, last Sunday, uh, 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 Sister Dolly sang the song, I am redeemed. Uh, I don't know about you, uh, but I am redeemed. Yeah. yeah, God has saved me, snatched me from darkness, uh, and now I walk in the light. Yeah. Every now and then, uh, and let's be honest, uh, Darkness stands in my way, uh, yeah. but I don't worry about it uh, because I know I can walk uh, yeah. through the darkness uh, and light is on the other side. Uh, I heard David say, uh, yea, though I walk uh, through the valley of the shadow of death, uh, I'm not seeing any evil uh, because I know the light uh, 
on the other side. Yes. Uh, darkness still come uh, in our lives, uh, but it's good to know uh, that darkness uh, cannot prevail. Uh, for the light that I have uh, will chase uh, a legion of darkness, uh, and your light can do that too. Uh, all you got to do uh, is let your light shine. Uh, thanks be unto God uh, that he has, uh, through his son Jesus, uh, delivered us uh, from the power of darkness. Uh, I won't fool you uh, and tell you that darkness can't hurt you. Darkness does uh, have a power, but it only have power if you let it have power. Keep in mind, uh, we have been uh, delivered from darkness. Uh, there's nothing in darkness uh, that can harm you, uh, but it'll make you harm yourself. Uh, it's like dead folks uh, in the cemetery. Uh, they can't hurt you, uh, but they'll make you hurt yourself. Uh, darkness, uh, yeah, will make you hurt yourself. Uh, but don't worry, uh, you've been delivered uh, from the power of darkness. Uh, God has uh, sent his son, uh, and the son has uh, given his life uh, that we can have uh, life with him. Uh, he has not only uh, delivered us uh, from the power of darkness, uh, but he has brought us uh, into his family, uh, into his household, uh, that we can now walk in the light. Yeah, yeah uh, I'm walking in the light. The beautiful light, uh, somewhere the dew drops, uh, a mercy shine bright, uh, it's all around me, uh, day and night, uh, I'm walking uh, in the light of the Lord, are you walking uh, in the light of the Lord, not worry uh, about the darkness that may come around you, just trust uh, in the light of the Lord and he shall deliver you with his light, you don't have to worry about what's in front of you because he will light the way even in darkness you ever thought about it? when you get up at night and 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 you got to walk through a dark house and all you got to do is hit that switch light comes on and you don't have to worry about stumbling over anything that's the way uh, being delivered from the darkness is like God gives you that light to light your pathway so that the darkness of this world will not harm you. He has. He said, he said, he said, in his word that I have delivered them. And no man or nothing can snatch them from me. Boy, that's worth shouting about. Amen. Once I'm in the Lord and he has delivered me from darkness, yeah. nothing or nobody can snatch me from Jesus wow. because he has all the power. All, all power. power. You ever think about that? You ever think about that? That, that when you're in the hands of God, <laughs> nobody, nobody, Mom and daddy might would have helped us come to Christ, mm -hmm. showed us the way. Mm -hmm. But when we accepted Jesus and he put us in his hands, mm -hmm. mama and daddy, preacher, deacon, husband and wife, nobody, nobody, nobody hear me, nobody, mm -hmm. nothing, not the president, not the government, right. nobody right. can snatch you. I remove you right. out of the hands of God. Mm -hmm. You ought to want to be there. Amen. Hey, it's like being in a ship that can't sink, mm -hmm. an airplane that can't crash, mm -hmm. a house that can't burn, mm -hmm. safe in the arms of Christ. Yeah. Why? Because I've been delivered. Yes. from darkness and darkness is a euphemism for sin All right. Amen. sin no longer reigns in my life mm -hmm. Amen. might slip in every now and then uh -huh. but he won't say All right. 
will not rain because I have been delivered. Quite a sister died to sing the song. She goes to church with us. Maybe that one that's fighting darkness. Darkness is overshadowing them and, and, and they're lost. You know, I, I, when I went to boot camp in the Navy, Firefighting is one of the most important things you have to learn uh, about being in the Navy and being on board ship. And in training, they put you in a smoke-filled room that's, that's dark, that's black. You get a chance to see where the exits are before the smoke comes in. And if you can't remember how to get out, or uh, uh, somebody have to come in and get you. Well, guess what? I was like that one time. I was surrounded, thank you, Holy Ghost, by darkness. Couldn't see my way out. Lord. But thanks be unto God, Jesus came in and got Brother Carl, I had no gray matter to hold his hand. Yes. Mm -hmm. I couldn't see where I was going, but as long as I held to his hand, I knew everything would be all right. Mm -hmm. Brother Stewart, he led me out. Mm -hmm. Out of the darkness into the newness of life. He's still doing that. Mm -hmm. He's still doing that for people that are in darkness, groping in darkness, not knowing where to go. But if they would just reach out to Jesus, and say, I believe in you. I know you're the one that can and will deliver me. And if you reach out, he'll come and get you and lead you out of darkness. Same thing, but I, I need to. Be quiet. Amen. If there's one.